What's good, Thrill Billies? Oh man, check it out. New gosh dang freaking trailer. Holy dick. <laughs> I got the wrong one. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I bought the wrong freaking trailer. I mean, I didn't buy the wrong trailer. I just, uh, it's not freaking wide enough. No, no. You alive? Oh, I apologize for that. This trailer here is about 82 and a half inches wide, right? The K20 over there is, is about 84 inches wide. I don't know why I didn't just freaking measure before I went to the gosh dang trailer place to buy a freaking trailer. Good boy. So, luckily, the one I, I was also looking at that was a little bit more expensive but is bigger and would be big enough with the drive over wheel wells and everything is still there and they're gonna let me get to some bitch. <sighs> Let's do it. Paperwork is done. Trailer's good. It's a lot freaking bigger. I'm about to load it up now. I'm happy about it. Get her now. Mother truckers, there's the new freaking trailer. Oh boy, this is a lot of sexy right here. Take an in-depth closer look. Oh snap. Look how good it looks. Come with a spare. God dang. Look at that. Well, just a look at it. Drive over freaking wheel wells, black diamond plate, looking sexy. It's got the dovetail rails in the back. Oh snap. Those aren't just ramps, ladies and gentlemen. Those are trailer boners. Oh my gosh, man. Just tits money. All right, just to be sure, we're gonna measure it out just on camera so you guys can see. See what it's out here. Now, mind you, you can drive over these wheel wells, but just so it doesn't have to become a weird, awkward thing. 84 and a half. So the K20 will freaking fit, baby. Yeah, honestly, I don't freaking have any clue why I didn't measure the K20. I, I knew it was 84, but for some reason in my head, I was like, oh, I think it's 81 or something like that. So, thought it was going to be fine. But there we freaking go, ladies and gentlemen. Got to love it. kind of funny every time <laughs> the k20s out of gas and i've been trying to freaking move it on this trailer for the past two days and it keeps running out of gas especially when i get to this point it just goes oh, 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 oh. so i don't think i'm making it all the way under the trailer but at least we can see it fits now yeah That right there, I love it. That's raining right where my gosh dang mud spot is. So tomorrow might be a good day for that. But first things first, the K20's out of gas, so I best fill that up. And I can't even make it to a gas station, so I'm gonna have to run with a gosh dang gas stand and then come back with it and fill it up and then go back to and fill it the rest of the way up. It's just a pain. Might have a little sag in her boobs, but it sure was love at first sight. Might have a little hair on her chest, but when I take a nap, it feels the breath. I drained the gosh dang battery, gonna run to the gas station in this, then uh, grab the freaking gas, fill up the gosh dang K20, put the K20 on the trailer, get it ready for tomorrow. Let's that. Come on. Yeah. Good God, dude. You're supposed to use a step. Whoa. Storms of Breen. Good boy. Thank you. 
to go. I hate these new freaking fill tubes. Why can't they just stick with the flexible old ones from the 90s? They work just fine. What are you doing in my spot? <laughs> you driving? Oh my goodness, it just started freaking pouring. Good God, I can't even remember how to work these windshield wipers. Holy dick, dude. Oh, that's some freaking cold ass rain, man. Get fat for this shit. What's cracking, fat boy? Not a lot. What's going on with you? Oh, nothing, man. Just freaking got a little gas. <laughs> oh, man, that reeks. Oh, yeah, it sure does. Damn. Now I'm just going to put some gas in this K20 here. Why do these new freaking nozzles got to be such a pain, dude? I freaking hate these sons of dicks. People are dumb. <laughs> Holy dick. I'm going to shove it in there. Yeah. Oh, son of a bitch. Just need to get enough in there to where it'll at least get up the trailer. Then we'll take it to the gas station to fill her all the way up. 91, baby. Ooh, the good stuff. Folks, this is gonna be one hell of a monkey job operation. I'm trying to kill myself. Well, holy dick, y'all. That was crazy. Well, we leveled it all the way to the back, and I'm gonna bring it all the way. Fat boy said I was sinking pretty good <laughs> with the bourbon being lifted and everything, but. Um, we're all good. I'm gonna tie her down now and then uh, probably head to the gas station grab some fuel <laughs> Well, I forgot the Papa outlaw had my straps left him over there So went and picked him up tie this some bitch down and then we'll see how the bourbon pulls it. I know it'll pull I pulled a freaking 8,500 damn pound travel trailer for months. <clears throat> this ain't that heavy so I know how to pull it, but yeah, we'll talk about that later. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I reckon that's going to do for today. Hey, if y'all enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a gosh dang thumbs up. And if you ain't yet, hit that freaking subscribe button. Tomorrow's going to be a good day. We take it to truck out. Let's see if we can get dirty. I know I was talking about something up there. I was like, oh, we'll talk about that later. Listen, y'all, I've been seriously thinking about getting a uh, a new rig to pull pull all my, my shit, so. Let the Ford versus Dodge versus Chevy comments commence in the comments. I ain't no joke either. I called my gosh dang broker. I said, listen, you best be looking out. <laughs> You guys probably already know what I'm looking for. So leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think I should freaking get. And with that being said, I reckon we'll see you in on the dip side. My name's Outlaw and I'm out, y'all. Always remember, no matter what you're doing, live two, three. Catch a fish, reel it on in. Take a little selfie to show all of my friends. I can throw a spinner or I can throw a crank. Impressing all the girls while they're tanning on the bank.